Hey there, Wutsu family, it's Ryan here, and I have to say, I am not the most handy of people. And when I say I'm not handy, I don't mean that I can't hang up cupboards or that I can't do stuff in the kitchen for the kitchen rentals. I'm talking about the very basic stuff when it comes to home ownership. Since my last vlog, we have finished the kitchen renovation. So all the cabinets are in, the, the countertops are in, the sinks are hooked up, the appliances have been put into place. The washroom renovations have been finished, so everything is going along well. But now that the big things are done, all of the little things are going to have to be done. And I mean, there is a lot of little things that goes into this that I need to learn to be handy about. Down in my basement, for instance, there's a light fixture that's right above the laundry tub that is not GFI grounded. I'm going to have to learn how to, you know, clip the, the wire that supplies power to it, shorten it, and move the plug up a lot higher so that it's not directly above running water in the sink. In my washroom, the renovated washroom, we've installed the, the sink and the hookup and everything else, but there's a tiny, tiny little drip that has to be sealed up, and I need to learn how to do that myself. Just outside our kitchen window, there's a tiny little hole below the window, and I noticed that wasps have been buzzing inside the window, and it's time for me to spray them out and then fill it in with some silicone. On both sides of the house, there is a gap where the neighbor's fence is and where the neighbor's fence is in the house. And so I need to now learn how to put up a fence because otherwise it's going to cost a lot of money to get somebody in to build it for me. When the home inspector came in and did his rounds in our house before we bought it, he gave me a 20-ish page list of observations and also things that I need to do to fix the house. Everything from fixing the fascia or fascia. I don't even like, that's the thing. A lot of these things, I don't actually even know how to say them. I kind of know what they are when you point to them, but it's like, yeah, I got to nail that thing so that animals can't get in or bugs can't get in or water can't get in. So I gotta go up and do these things even if I don't know what they're called. Now when it comes to being handy, it's kind of a tricky thing because there's a certain amount of things that I think a homeowner is reasonably expected to be able to handle themselves. And then there's a good chunk of things that I think a professional should do. But little kind of repairs around the house, like sealing up little gaps in the outside of the house because it is an older house that is settled. Like that should be stuff that I can do weatherproofing windows, weatherproofing the door, which by the way, we gotta also replace the door, which is not something I know how to do. And I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I feel like either as an adult, which is a kind of more appropriate way to think about this, or as a guy, which is not really a good way to think about this, these are things that I should know. So let's just ignore the guy thing. And as an adult, sometimes I feel like I'm failing and that I should know how to do these things. However, all is not lost because I know plenty of handy friends who would probably be willing to answer my dumb questions and there is a whole huge ecosystem on YouTube of various people who've done lots of videos on how to do stuff. I found a few new YouTube people that I've subscribed to that I watch their videos and I'm going to be learning along the way. At least when it comes to making these videos, I'm a little bit handy. So I guess all is not lost. It's not that I don't have skills. It's that right now the skills that I have aren't necessarily going to be the ones that ensure that bugs aren't going to get into my house, which by the way, earwigs are the worst. Anyways, comment down below on the kind of skills that you think you should have, whether or not it's academic or handy skills, life skills or whatever. I'm interested to hear what you have. It was Red Green who said that if the ladies don't find you handsome, then at least they can find you handy. I guess it's going to have to be the other way around. The people are just going to have to find me handsome instead of handy. Anyways, take care and we'll see you next time. Don't forget, stay awesome.